Hello everyone, I'm South African leader Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in South Africa, Pure Reich. So, last time we saw the world go a little kaboom in Europe. Now, mostly because, well, the French and the Italians were beating each other up, and then the Germans wanted some French territory, or really some really German territory in the Rhineland. And so it looks like the Germans are doing well. We have the factions here, three-way, four-way, five-way faction in Europe, very cool. One, two, three, four, five, well, one, two, three, four wave factions in Africa. Now, we're not, we are currently not at war. That's why I still have volunteers in Italy. We are not at war yet. However, I want to be at war very, very soon. Now, uh, a few comments. First of all, someone said you should get the, the UK to ally with the French, maybe. Just so, other than that, it's going to be a pretty easy war, which I'm not opposed to, seeing as... South Africa can't do a ton. They can do some. They can't do a ton. We can't do a whole lot. We don't have tanks. We're not a major power. We only have 33 factories. You know what it is. But I still want to take as much of Africa as humanly possible. That being said, the Germans should be able to shatter the Rhineland and move straight into um, France proper. Wow, you already have claims on Nancy, huh? That's definitely interesting. Uh, anything else? Nope, that's cool. Uh, but yeah, we're not at war yet. I just kind of want to see what happens with the Germans. Because once... The Rhineland falls, and it'll be probably pretty easy for us. But I do want to contest some French ships. There's really no point to not go to war for now. Ooh, anti-Bolshevik pack seems pretty nice. And these guys are attacking pretty ferociously here. I mean, we could help attack. Maybe get some more XP, but it really doesn't matter. I want to get ready and go to war with these guys anyways. Once we have our naval invasion set up, which I actually created off-screen just right before I started recording, you know, whatever. Uh, let's see. How is the planning going for these guys? We need a few more days. Let's watch what happens. We can probably help out the battle here in Italy, which is cool. They're beating back the French, which is awesome. So the Italians are very weak. Now, will the Germans go to war with the Italians once the French are done? Maybe. Perhaps. I don't know. I have no idea. Like I see the Weltkrieg, Tiger Fable. Uh, but some more comments. Uh, once we see this demand suit to roll, they'll do that eventually. Um, yeah, Romania is disgusting. Uh, State Chester Tool Mod currently doesn't work for Führerreich for some reason. Not sure why. Oh, well. That being said, I can't really change things around. I could have released Romania here or for either side, really, but eh, they both deserve Romanian territory. So we'll see what happens. If I had State Chester Tool Mod on or available, I'd probably give this part of German Romania to Hungary because they're in the Pact of Rome. And then have Italy give Germany, like, Moldova probably, to make it a little bit more balanced, a little more equal around the, this, like, this horizontal line I'm looking at that doesn't exist. Regardless, we have a little bit of political power. What do we do with the political power? Fighters, we're not releasing really fighters. Artillery would be pretty good. I don't have that much artillery anyways. We have a little bit, not much. Can I throw some on our main? Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. I like that idea. And how many more days do we have to wait? Four more days, which is fine. Whatever. That's not bad. I do want to invade this part of Africa. Hopefully we can. I'm really hoping that we can. It looks like we got one more sub as well. They're still killing... Oh, someone just overran down here. Alright, well, they have tanks. That makes sense. Uh, what's going on? Oh, yeah. So, these guys. Uh, there's really not much we can do about that. I might save this political power, though. Just so that I can raise my economy level. Is it economy level? What is it called? I've been playing this game for three years. I don't know. Yeah, it is economy law. Economy law. And the Germans, though, they're doing better in the Rhineland. They're... Mm, they're struggling a little bit. But they have pushed through Moselen. Okay, so there, I guess that makes sense since, since there's no forts there. But forts over here. Yeah, Germany, I don't think I would recommend attacks like this. That seems a little dangerous. The French Republic is down there. That's fine. Whatever. How's this looking? Ooh, our guys are looking pretty weak, but that's just mostly because they're missing support equipment and infantry equipment. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. I need more goods already. I'm gonna get some motorized. Do I really need motorized right now? Wait, do any divisions really need motorized? No. Uh, these guys sort of do. Uh, just keep it on for now then. So be it. I wish you could help support the attack. Yeah, no, no, if they're not winning, I, I don't want to take part in that. Nope. Ooh, look at a little breakthrough here. Come on, AI. Take that province, cut these two guys off. Or take that province. And take Mets as well. Iran has declared war. Oh. 
Oh, that's a question. Imperial Protection Alliance. Why? You have claims on there, yes. Enforce women's education. Now that is pretty progressive for Muhammad here. Wow. Oh, what happened? Salvador, Central America. Now that is one longer United Mexican States boy. Ooh. You got a little, a little more chubby there. Cool. But we have military crackdown. Less stability, more political power. We have a lot of political power. Next up, let's see. I could do our own strategies. That's pretty good. Grand Battle Fleet. Oh, Naval Doctrine sounds really nice uh, this time of year. We can't do this yet because the UK is not at war with anyone else, which is fine, whatever. Hmm. Lock down the Rhodesia. The former government of our nation was content with letting the situation in the Rhodesia spiral out of control. We must not be. Send in the tanks and lock down the province until it learns its place in the Union. That's good. Learn your place. Nice. Uh, send divisions that way. Just in case. Now, th these guys... They're still not there yet. Roads. Oh, they're actually not too bad. Could be better, but they're not too bad. Keep building up an industry down here. Why is it so laggy? What's going on? Oh my goodness. Hmm. The UK's down there a little bit. Alright. Industrial Revolution. Renovation, not revolution, but renovation seems pretty nice. Ooh, generic stuff. I'm really tempted to get this, just for a little bit more soft attack. Mm, research speed isn't bad. What about our trade? Eh, we're doing okay with trade laws as well. I could raise my... Oh, I guess I... Hmm, we're on this. Can't go to this yet. We're not at war. Makes sense. Makes sense. Ministers, Milan, you know, he is who he is. Oh, there goes the Rhineland. Great news! Throw on that. Great job, guys. How is this coming down here? Well, struggling a little bit. And now this is proper French territory that the Germans might not be able to break through. Ooh. What's the, what, what are the losses thus far? The Second Great War. That's not bad. That's actually pretty good. That's a lot of dead French guys. Not a single Stahlhelm on French soil, huh? A lot of divisions, good amount of manpower. Germany has a lot of manpower. Makes sense. They might actually be able to break through here, which would be great for Alsace. Alright, we got enough things here. Let's see if we can go to war and join them. Yeah, probably want to join Deutsches Reich for this. Probably. Oh. Nice. Now, give it just a little bit of time first, before I attack. Hmm. Sure. Um... We'll see what happens with that. We could probably go for now. Go and do some escorting for now. I wonder if I can invade those provinces correctly. Oh, hello. Are you spreading out like you should? Very nice. Actually, you probably don't actually want to be there. We want to help take out the rest of Africa. So you might consider staying down here, actually. Ah, Dictate of Serbia. Yes, please. Alright, so... Pretty good on war support. I like that war bonds. Looks pretty good. Nationalized chromium. Propaganda campaigns. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, that's only... That's... That's not much. That's like five weeks. You get 2.5% more war support. More factory output's always nice. Let's grab this. Good. Build up Natal. Build faster. Build, build, build. They took Alsace, which is awesome. They might take this next province, too. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Can we do well here? We are on the way to French Equatorial Africa. And our divisions are back home. Good. Throw them under there. Come on. Come. Oh, yay! We're locked down Rhodesia, even though it was demilitarized eventually. Oh, Luxembourg. Good. Oh, and... Okay. Okay, that's... A good way to try to get into more France, spread out their divisions even more, which is nice. Uh, we need to do more. Do we encourage violence or reservations? Well, this hurts our stability more, so we'll do this one first. By making large swaths of the Kalahari territory a single reservation, we could theoretically begin a process of removal of natives from the rest of the country. Yes. Well, very good for us. Very good. Oh my god, we need so many guns. So many guns. And there goes Luxembourg, which... Oh, can we... Easy invasions. Come on. Land those boys. Come on. There you go, my friends. We have landed. And begin the end of French rule in Africa. 
They're just gonna come around here, maybe, and circle that group. The rest of you guys begin convoy raiding. Uh, you guys are gonna look great. I want to keep these guys down here just for that, for now. I might send these other eight divisions up there. You guys are doing awesome. Coast Guards... I only need two down south. For now, that looks okay. Oh! Oh, and Japan's doing that. Um, I guess Luxembourg never joined a faction. I'll just give it to Germany. That makes the most sense. There you go, Germany. Happy Stadt Luxembourg. Boy, are good. Very good, very good, very nice. Go, I... Let's see. Eh, infrastructure could be worse. It's level 3, which isn't terrible. Oh. Good, you guys go that way and just... See if you can cut them off. See what you can do about that. Nice. Duala. Have we encountered any ships here? Ah, some convoys. Very good. They're attacking us. It's always good to be on defense. Good, let one guy go that way. One guy hang out here. Actually, that's okay. Keep them there. That's nice. Infrastructure's pretty bad. Um, Poland wants to send me... I can't get over the way this guy looks. I, 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 just, I just can't. Hey, look! A victory! That's not much, but it's still a victory. I love it. You guys are looking okay-ish. Oh, you're taking some serious supply hits. Uh, You know what? Just come back up here, then. I don't know why supply is so bad down here. It's level 5. That's actually not bad whatsoever. It's probably because there are mountains and stuff like that. Be careful with what you're doing. But keep moving. Uh, oh, actually, we can go straight to these lines, which is not bad. Nice. Now, help support the attack here. Because they're going to need to waste supplies, and the faster we can kill them off there, the better. Brazzaville, we need definitely, 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 definitely. Cut those guys. Oh, actually, those guys won't get cut off since there's Brazzaville there. Might consider doing that. Come on. Any other guys around here? No? Good, good, good. Probably really need logistic companies. Let's see, we weren't defeated. That's good. Take that. Oh, but they have more supplies through Belgium down here. Hmm. Disappointing. Uh, I should, you guys should probably come right there. Cut those guys off and kill off that one division. You guys come there. And it's kind of hard to see. We'll do that. Come on, kill him off. Getting a little bit more of XP. Are there any more shippies around here? No? Okay, Japan. Uh, okay. Oh. That's an interesting flag. The Russo-Japanese... My goodness, that's something I never thought I would see. The Russo-Japanese Alliance? What is this, Victoria 2? Uh... I wish I knew which way they were going. Institution of Subjugation? Oh. Yeah, it's probably somewhere down here. Nanshin Ron. Hokushin Ron. Hmm. Defeat the cliques? The three race co prosperity stock. Oh. Not enough man. Oh my god, I need more manpower. Hmm. And yeah, more equipment. Really keys more equipment. So, if that's the case, bye bye. No, that's not bad. If you can get rid of those guys, that'd be great. We're doing my... I'm trying to do my part. And as long as the Dutch state's doing well, and Germany's doing well, and the Italians are doing well, Italian things, we should do okay. Hmm. More war propaganda. Not bad. I could use more output. Air Force really doesn't matter. That doesn't really matter. This doesn't really matter. I could raise that. I want to build another factory, though. This is 100 political power. That's not really worth it, though. War bonds. What are we making? I could really use another military factory, to be honest. Do that. Yeah, since we got the manpower, or political power, we might as well do that. And, good. And Belgium, Belgium is gone. Now they're under us. Great. Great. Uh, cool. Next up, policy of removal. So, despite what the ANC coalition and the United Party may have said, it is impossible to keep the peace in cohabitation with the natives. Work and removal programs are the next necessary step to resolve that long-standing crisis. That just means more territory we have to cover, which is, eh, not really super ideal, but whatever. 
Keep those guys there. I really don't want them to see them expand. You guys come up there, too. Good. Uh, well, actually, we've got... Because of the capitulation of the Belgians, they gave us more stuff. Azerbaijan is gone. Cool. They gave us their infantry equipment, which is awesome. And a little bit of motorized, which I really, really fully enjoy. Wow. You are really killing yourselves over here. Kus I hope you're doing well. Well, oh, the cancel the Lundleys, which is, you know, whatever. Whatever. Come on, get rid of these guys. For Lamy, that's okay. I mean, the Belgians are completely capitulated. Once the French are gone, hopefully the Germans, or even the Italians, could help us out taking out French West Africa. That is the plan. The major plan. Eh, uh, that's unfortunate. Good, we, got, we finally got rid of them. That took so long to get rid of these guys. All right, let's redouble this. Right there to about like there-ish. Port Lamy. Is that a province in itself? Oh, there's two divisions there. Hmm. Move up that way. Move up that way. Just take whatever we can since we're not going to find too much resistance here. I mean, there's resistance. No resistance. Okay, no resistance. Thumbs up for me then. 1940 sub hole. Awesome. Wolf packs? Oh yeah, let's make our guys even more dangerous. I love it. It's almost 1940, so let's just grab more research speed now. Very good. Africa is doing a lot better than I did, thought it would. Now, as long as we don't go to war with the UK, this is completely manageable, and the Dutch state really wants all of their north coast. Yeah, the French are going to die. And the Italians are so close to getting encircled here. And that's awesome. Hmm, what do we do with this stuff? I don't really want to lower my construction speed. Because it's doing pretty darn well. I'm not gonna lie, doing pretty darn well. Please, I would like to find more ships to go make go kaboom, please. Thank you. Uh you might actually be able to, you know, help them out for now. They can try to liberate this place. Uh, you know, liberate the place. You just move in there. Armenia declare war on Kurdistan, that's cool. You're going to do this. You're going to do a gamer move. You're going to go in there. You're going to go up there and circle them. Ooh, mountains. Or oh, hills. That's okay. All this part of the Congo is merely a distraction. That's all it is. I want these guys to move in. We'll encircle and we will destroy. Hmm. It's okay. Just keep them there. You're going to cut these guys off if possible. The policy of removal, though. Now we have encouraged violence. By encouraging our nationalistic followers to commit acts of violence across the country, we may be able to create a justification for a police force controlled by the PNP that can enforce our will and laws throughout the land. Hmm. Milan is definitely having a time. Getting more daily artillery is not bad. Uh, I really don't like this. Go ahead and hold, because attacking them here is not a good idea. Oh, you sent volunteers. I don't like that. If that's the case, you guys might be able to help out right there. A little bit of lag. Good. At least push them back out this way. So we can get over there and cut them off go up that way. Now, happy 1940, my friends. Happy 1940. There is some serious lag, and I'm going to blame South America for that one. Oh, that's why there's lag. I found it. The Französische Freistadt. Oh, Jacques Doriot. Well, welcome back, I guess. Looks like the Italians didn't get much here, which is, you know, whatever. It is what it is. I can't do anything about it, since I don't have uh, state transfer tool not working. And that is disgusting. Why is this owned by the French? What the heck? Maybe they'll trade it off later on. Um, okay, people don't like Armenia, which I guess makes some sense. You know, whatever. And how's this war going? going okay, I guess. I don't know. can't really tell. Still get over two political parties. You know what? That, if, that, if that's a point, if that's the case, give me more output right now. I could use more output. Oh, and the guys that definitely showed up down here. Really, Britain? Really? You gonna do this to me? Can you actually just come up that way? Uh, good. Curtis Sam's gone. If that's the case, if we could just smash through here and have you two, or someone, come up there and have the other one just take the capital. If we could just take the capital and cut all these guys off and kill all the Brits, that'd be amazing. That'd be extremely delightful. Okay, go that way. Please, why do these places in Africa have to be so big? It is not very nice. Let them think that they can win. Just cut them off that way. Now, I expect the Italians to do pretty well against the French here in Africa, which will help us defeat them. 
So where is the main... Oh, uh, it's the French Republic. It's literally like Kaiser right now. Wait, hold on, hold on. Why do... Oh, okay. I thought it was Germany that had claims on this. It's just the French... German... The German French puppet. Yeah. Words. Yeah. Cool, cool. Come on, I made more subs for a reason. Uh, okay. Well, whatever. Another fleet. Looking good. Looking nice. Good. Let them attack us. Let them see how they like it. Good. Push in. Go up to Fort Lamy. Let the Italians do well down here. It's really weird that they did not get, uh, Provence. But whatever. Next, let's have government police. The recent violence across the country has led to calls to create a government police force to keep the order. It will also be useful for enforcing laws, which some in the country may not be prepared to accept. We're only casually 60%, you know, national populace, that's all. 60%, that's all. You know, not much. Yeah, at this point, you might as well do that. We're pretty good on war propaganda. I hope the Germans send soldiers down here. Well, yeah, they definitely are. Ooh, supplies not going to be looking good. Are we done with that military? Yeah, we're done with that military factor. We're done with a lot of things, actually. Go ahead and build up, like, Cameroon and Gabon. That actually is probably a smart idea to do because, well, supply is going to be an issue. Good. There's one, two. We're going to need another division this way. If that's the case, I'm going to go ahead and shrink this just by a little bit. There we go. I mean, they can have the Congo. I mean, there's not really much in the Congo that we super, super want. I mean, they got a little bit of rubber here and there, and maybe some tungsten, but... Eh, the long-term success means we get Fort Lamy, capitulate these guys, they die, we have a good time. Come on, you guys can do it. I know... Oh, no, maybe not. Oh, boy. You guys just hold for now. Reorganize ourselves a little bit more. Uh, actually, you know what? We can scrunch the numbers even further. There you go, because Germany is showing up here, which is awesome. You come up there. Hmm. Guns, huh? We don't need nearly as much artillery. That'd be fine. Get some more metal from these guys. That's good. That'd be okay. Nice. Another infantry division. Looking, looking fabulous. Put you on low. Put you both on low. That'd be good. Armor divisions, coast. Eh, get rid of that. Hmm. Trying to attack in Africa. Probably not the smartest idea. Can you win here now? The, the guy left. You might, oh, y'all might be able to. We might be able to capitulate them. And Yaran declared war on Arab. Mashriq. Wait, hold on. Georgia, they're fighting each other. Oh. Are you allied with anyone? You are just supplying against these guys. The Phoenician Republic over here. Huh. Everyone wants a piece of France since they're pretty much dying. Oh! Germany even invaded this part. East Togoland. Nice! I'm loving this timeline for South Africa. Well, some people might not, but whatever. A new constitution? Sure! Even more political power. In order to solidify our hold on the nation and ensure that our new laws and institutions remain in place, we must write a new document separate from the ones forced upon us by the Empire to determine our own fate. I love constitutions when they suit our needs. Oh, good job, Germany. Good job. Or, yeah, that's German. Capitulate the French. Wait. Wait, what? Uh... Why do I get that option? Oh, wait. When did you join the Stahl Pact? Oh, my goodness. That's just gonna put the Germans at war with the Third International. Oh, boy. Uh... I'm gonna say no for now, like, bruh. Wait, hold on. The oh, it was the Russian Republic, not the Soviet Republic, that's fine. Alright, well, this is. This is a definite timeline. And of course, we have the Kingdom of Spain, which has sent volunteers or guaranteeing the independence of Cuba and Venezuela. So, these guys are not fighting the Russians yet. Soon enough, though, soon enough. You know, I will give you a little bit more command power just so we can hurry up and take Fort Lamy and then kill everyone else off here. Uh, I love plans like that. Ah, there goes Peru. Okay, well, they, they're gone. You can probably put your nose in here. Put your, wait, what the heck? What? what oh, holy cow, where are you going, my son? Um... 
That is kind of radical, not gonna lie. A little radical for how you uh, approach that direction. And since you're here, you might as well help take them out. And then push just directly to the right. Just cut everyone else off. Come on, capitulate French Equatorial Africa. Oh my goodness, now we're at war with the Russians. That's not a good thing. How are they not capitulated yet? Where's the capital? Oh, uh, sure, sure. I'm not, I'm thinking a war against the Soviet Union, guys, right now, really isn't smart. Oh boy, that's really not smart. It would be super smart. Oh, what was that? Equatorial something? You get rid of these guys first. How are these guys not dead? Hold on. Uh, they are at 98%. Well, I guess that makes some sense. Sure, yes. No, no guys, I think, we're, I think we're okay. I think we'll be okay. Beat him up, beat him up. Help beat him up. Oh, ooh. Wait, why did you go to war with the Soviet Union and the Ukraine? You're gonna push them into their, ar their arms. No. Germany, what are you doing? You're being crazy. Oh, those guys are gone. That's always good. Oh, why would you go to war with both these guys at the same time? It makes sense if, like, the Soviets declared war on the Ukraine, and then we went to war as well, but... You're crazy. You're nuts. Civil crackdown? Um, eh. Maybe a little later. Maybe a little later. Propaganda? I mean, it just really doesn't matter. We already have enough war support. It, doesn't, it really doesn't matter at all. Chief of the Air Force? We wants to do interception stuff. I don't know. It doesn't really matter at all. Uh, you can help take them out here. That's fine. You guys are taking those guys out. You guys... You probably can't win there, which is fine, whatever. I mean, my goal is just to take this little piece of Africa. <gasps> Yay! We did it! We did it, we did it, we did it. Good. Get rid of them. Improved artillery. Awesome. Let's grab some more gun stuff. Improved infantry, infantry equipment too. Central Congo has to go. Uh, you hold. And have a good time. You guys do that. Nice. Get rid of these guys. They don't deserve to be here. Look at that. That's beautiful. Mmm. I love it. How many guns do we need? Oh, we need a lot of guns. Holy cow. Well, packs great. Let's get the next one with Advanced Submarine Warfare. Oh, man. We are dying down here. Oh, they're going to unite, which is not good. But can they really move if we do nothing there? Hmm. That's disappointing that we lost there. But we won here. Oh, they lost, but they're still attacking. Okay, well, whatever. You guys come that way. Get rid of them. Get rid of them. Hmm. Love it. Manpower's looking pretty awesome. What? Germany. Germany. You were doing so well. Why are you going to war with everyone on the front? Uh, enshrine segregation. The time has come to enshrine our institution of segregation and separation into law. The international law be damned. The country belongs to no one but us. Wow, this is going in a really certain direction. And maybe that's okay. I don't know. Depends on your preference, I guess we'll say. Uh, I need... I need doggos. Wait, no, this is not Old World Blues. I need military police. Hmm. I play too much Old World Blues. And that's okay. Hmm. Our new constitution. Ooh, hungry. Yes. So the National Government of South Africa today has passed a new constitution to govern the nation. It was passed by the House of Assembly without a single non-coalition vote. And while the United Kingdom will refuse to... Re recognize its legitimacy, it will become the de facto law of the land for the Union. In writing this new constitution, however, some internal debate within the coalition has threatened its proper implementation and recognition. Some in the coalition, largely the Valkists, are pushing for clauses to be included which would solidify our stability and strive to create a stable and lasting system. Others from the purified National Party, by contrast, are pushing for clauses which would ensure continued national rule for the foreseeable future. No matter which side or which clauses are adopted, the coalition risks fracturing, though that remains highly unlikely. Building our own power... A lasting society. A lasting society sounds a lot better because we already get enough political power. Of course, we'll see what happens. Oh yeah, oof. yeah. I wonder if this video is going to ever get monetized on YouTube. With what I've said in this episode, I guess time will tell. Good. Oh, that's not good. Just hold on for now. I need logistic companies too, though. Hmm. Oh, the goes Beijing. That's good. That gives more divisions to Japan and Russia. Someone was overran, which is, you know, I think that should be okay. It's looking okay there. Yeah, keep them down. Keep them down. Hmm. 
The Republic of Armenia is gone. Everyone hates Armenians for some reason. So be it. So be it. Uh, they're attacking us. They're starving for supplies, even though we kind of are doing the same thing. Definitely could use more weapons. I hate to do it like that, but I definitely need more guns than support equipment right now. Next up is military police, though. When we get it. Someday. Eventually. I don't know when. Oh, come on, man. I need your lend lease. I need more guns. Guns make the man. Go ahead and put him down. Put him down. And the UK is being very aggressive. Hopefully we can call out U United Kingdom aggression here. That's not good, man. <sighs> Germany. Why? Just why? Nice, very nice. Oh, this is, this is looking good. That is just tasty. You guys get down there. You guys hurry up down there. We want to fish this area of the world off first, as fast as possible before we get into other parts of Africa. So then we can just focus more with a more concentrated force. Uh, I really don't want to fight these other people yet. I really don't. Now, I'll probably have to use Player League Peace Conferences when we do the peace deal, just because I do want all of Africa, and I don't think Adam Dresser really cares about Africa that much. I could be wrong, I could be very wrong about that, but we'll see what happens. Nice. Give us time to get more... Oh, we got plenty of guns now! Nice. Very nice. Manpower. Looking nice. We will invade this part of West Africa, though, which will be very good. And the Brits are just kind of hanging out. Good. Cancel the lease, you know, whatever. Chromium. Nationalist rally. Ah, uh, let's get the manpower, or political power. 52%. We have plus 0.55 a day. We get over two a day still. Not much more than two, but, you know, it is what it is. Hmm. You know what? Go ahead and grab you three. Put you under someone else. Start coming up here. Nyami. Hmm. We, we might as well grab... Oh! Von Rensberg. Von Rensberg. Come on, Italy, do more here. Enshrine segregation and our own path. So, with our separation from the Empire complete and our independence secure, we've been able to grow and thrive as a nation. No longer will old liberal policies keep us down. South Africa belongs to us and us alone. Let the world tremble. Whew. Interesting. Segregation enshrined. So our nation has long struggled to become to, or come to terms with the conflict between natives and settlers. The British refused to take action, and the settlers in Cape have always fought equality or sought equality and integration. After the Third Boer War, political parties shut Boer voices out of government and legislated it as they saw fit. Yet now, with the Boers in control of our government, we find that they have the ability to enshrine segregation into law. Doing so will no doubt enrich natives and those in Cape Province, who continue to demand a public referendum on the matter and threaten a mass protest if denied. Well, let them rage, they don't get to choose. <clears throat> yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Our own path. Well, this is turning into a very special campaign. Hmm. Yeah, that sounds pretty normal. Oh, look at that. That is the last of the lands. We almost have them. And then, once... Look, once Africa's done, and if the UK is going to stay, like, out of the wars for... Japan, why? Out of the wars for that? Why does the Russian Republic own this? What the heck? Is that up? Hmm. I don't know. Chongsi Cleek. Oh, that's a bad idea. That's... Actually... Okay, you made it up there, makes, which makes sense. Is the Russian Republic not fighting the Soviet Union? They're not. Oh, guys, come on. What? Wait, so you guys went to war... Well, Japan went to war with Russia. Well, the Soviet Union. The Russian Republic didn't go to war with the Soviet Union. But they called in the Germans on the other front to go to war with the Soviet Union. What is this timeline? This doesn't make any sense. No, Germany. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. But not yet. This is the case. We can probably spend less time down here because we really don't need to do this yet. Up here, we can wait. I want more civilian factories first and maybe some refineries because we could use more fuel as well. I'm liking fuel. Maybe just a touch of rubber. A small... T oh, my goodness. Could we win there? A small touch of rubber. Hmm. Not bad. I'm sorry, guys. I don't think my navy is going to do that much against them. I might even consider doing this. You can get rid of this. Spend more time over here. Improved computing machine. Great. Let's grab anything else here. Probably not. Let's grab some better guns. I love better guns. Propaganda. We're good. Yunnan. That's good. Civil crackdown. Mm. Eh, screw it. We'll do it. No, Russia. You're not... 
Why would I join the war? You're not even in the war yourself. Oh, and that's probably why we can't win right here, because they threw in some tanks. If that's the case, go ahead and send you to the other side here. Oh, wait. Oh, I researched. Oh, I did say I want military police. I forgot. Oh, look at this. The French Republic is gone. Thank you, my friends. Thank you. Uh, so now I'm going to try to do this without cheating too much. I do have player piece of conferences on, so I'm going to take a lot of this uh, score first. So I think that'll be good. Let's just go ahead and give most of the territory on the continent of Europe to Germany. Because that just makes sense. As well as Italy. Let's be real. As well as Italy. If that's not already pieced out. Cool. So Germany. You obviously deserve the Rhineland because that would make sense why you don't. That's still discussing why they own that. Whatever. Now, Italy does deserve a piece of Africa. That being said, long term, they're not going to own this because I would like it. They'll probably get all of this. Oh, Marrakesh. They might have Moroccan separatists. I think for now, Germany is content with that, as well as Belgium. Give them all of this. That'd be pretty good. Mm, you might as well give them this, too, for now. Let's, let's do it like that. Oh, they took this? Why did they take care? Mm, screw that. I'm taking the rest of this, then. Give me the Congo. Nice. And even though Germany took this, uh, they'll probably just... Let's just say they'll give it to me. They probably don't want to deal with African things. Nice. That definitely gives Italy some more land in Africa, which we'll obviously take out later on. I don't know why they got Cameroon. Ooh, hello. You're close enough to me that I think we should take you. Reunion. Uh, they have other lands as well. Let's see. Over here, probably this should go to... Germany? Germany? Oh, maybe the Dutch would have wanted that. Anything else around here? Oh, Portugal, Commonwealth of Australia. Over here? You know what? Let's give this to the Dutch state. Let's make them feel like they, they earn their keep as well. Besides, I will give the Dutch state more of Belgium. I wanted to give this to Germany too, but I'm thinking we'll see what happens. Uh, they might give this... If this belongs to Germany, then the Dutch state should give it to them. I'll give this to them too, though. Alright, so... Oh, these guys capitulated as well? <sighs> now, it only makes sense for Germany to get this part too. So, Deutsches Reich, you can have this and that, 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 and that, because I don't think Italy really went after them. That's good. And now we have French Indochina. Oh, over here. Uh, well, this is... This should go to Italy. This should, that makes only sense for Italy to take that. Next up. Oh, down here. Oh, Dutch state, Italy. Italy really has no claims. No one really has claims over here, so... I could take this. That wouldn't make too much sense for me. You know what? Mm, I'm going to take this and actually just give it to the... Ch not Chinese. No, I'm not going to do that. No, no, no. I was thinking about giving it to the Chinese. Hungary. Does anyone really deserve this? Libya, Slovakia. Uh, you know what? We'll give it to friends. This is a fresh dot. That, that makes sense. So the puppet has a puppet. There you go. And then... French Republic. I'm not sure where else they are. Are they over here? Oh, they are over here. Uh, Dutch state. Now, I I really don't know where the rest of, the, where the rest of them are at. St. Pierre. Just... Hmm. Dutch state. You can have these guys. Tahiti. Just take the rest of that. It doesn't matter. Whatever. And then French Indo. Wait. Oh, probably right there. Just. All right. Now that makes sense. Well, it makes a little sense. So you guys have this. They have that. That's very nice. Oh my goodness. And we got these guys. Great. Thank you, Germany. I love you, Germany. Now we got to. Oh, we have a big old front with the potential war with the UK. They'll probably be the last ones we take out, though. That being said, I do want to earn my keep and put myself on the front against Russia, perhaps, just so that we feel like we have. We will fully have paid off Germany, because I have no interest in, you know, Russian lands, Soviet lands. 
So we'll probably go to war with the Soviets and help them out, even though eh, they're so strong. But anyways, we're going to end that episode there. If you liked today's video, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow as we help out against the war against the Soviet Union and maybe get into a conflict with either the Italians or the United Kingdom. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.